Morning, El Camino. It's Pastor Bruce. It is Christmas week, and uh, everybody, I think, is probably a little excited. Uh, maybe some of us are a little bit worked up because we're still not done getting everything shopped for or whatever the case may be or getting all the things ready for the whatever get-together, family get-togethers you're going to be having. And, uh, but but it's, a, it's an exciting week, and if you've got little kids around, grandkids around, it is really exciting. I mean, you can see the intensity level rising with each day. Um, it's a fun time when you can be together with your family and, and see the excitement and feel the fun and the joy of, of, of Christmas. And, and we have an opportunity as followers of Christ uh, to celebrate the birth of Christ and what he has done as uh, the greatest gift of all time. And uh, the one that brings us the most joy and the most fulfillment and, and the one that changes everything. And so we get kind of a, a, a twofer in all of this. Um, there's a verse that uh, speaks a little bit about this excitement and what it is that drives it, that in our lives. And it's a verse I've, I've known for quite a long time, um, used it in a variety of, of circumstances when um, I needed a little uh, <laughs> encouragement. It comes from Proverbs chapter 13. It's verse 12, and it reads, Hope deferred makes the heart sick, but desire fulfilled is a tree of life. When we are struggling and we, we have things that, that we hope for, that we long for, and, and it's not happening, it's not happening, it's not happening, and it, it, it can get to you, right? Hope deferred makes the heart sick. But when it finally comes, when that which we are longing for comes to fruition, it's fulfilled. When Christmas finally gets here, it's life. It's, it's, a, it's a wonderful, beautiful thing. We all need hope, and we need um, fulfillment of hope. We need to see the promise fulfilled. Have a great Christmas a great opportunity to talk about our hope being fulfilled in Christ, celebrating that, celebrating with your family, watching life in your home um, with kids, grandkids. Maybe on your um, online you get to watch and see what happens when desire is fulfilled and hope is brought to life. See you soon, church.